Hi guys, I'm Joe the Multiboxer. Today I'm going to show you how to use ISBoxer 2 uh, to multibox games and other applications like Notepad uh, that are not supported by Innerspace and do not work with ISBoxer 1. Um, so let's get right to it. We're going to create a Notepad multiboxing team. Create a new team. Um, so you start by adding team members to ISBoxer 2. Um, game. Uh, obviously, Notepad's not in this list, so I'm going to pick Other game location I have no game locations defined so let's get started um, you can import from interspace but in this case we're going to use non interspace windows so let's start by naming notepad uh, and still other game and the way this is going to work we're going to instead of having it launch notepad for it, us we're going to have it detect um, notepad that we launch ourselves so we'll import and we're done with that. So now we've got a notepad game location to use for our team members. And I'm going to set up notepad 1 and notepad 2. Um, so that's our team. I'm going to name it notepad duo. Uh, so now that's not going to do much exciting yet. So let's add some modules. Uh, I meant to show you how to install these, so I'm going to just delete those. So we'll download and install the video effects layout module, uh, which implements a basic video effects layout using an assigned team member to host the layout. Uh, so install that. And the window capture module, which sets up a hotkey to capture the active window in TIE Xbox or 2. So once we set up this hotkey, we're going to press the hotkey, um, and it's going to find our notepad and it's going to put that in our team uh, with the video effects layout. So install that and we're done installing modules. Um, so we're going to set these to auto load but for until we relaunch IS Boxer uh, we will load them ourselves here. So video effects layout is going to need a DX nothing window um, to use to host the video effects layout. So let's go to the team members tab and we're going to add a just like we did with notepad kind of just uh, a DX nothing game location so in this case it is an interspace window and we're going to use DX nothing client um, DirectX 11 64 bit um, you can use and you can use the DirectX 9 or 11 it doesn't really matter in this case I'm choosing DirectX 11 64 bit So now we've added the game location, finished creating the uh, team member. So we can just leave it named DX nothing one. Create and add. So we do not need to create a team. This is the same uh, quick setup that we used to create the team. But in this case, we just need to create a team member. Um, so let's go back to the module setup. And now we can pick DX nothing one here and save the setting. And now for the window capture, there's no module settings that we need to do. Um, rather, there's uh, hotkeys. Um, if they're not there, reload the module. And there it is. So I'm going to set that to Control-Shift-Alt-W. Um, set it to something that works for you. Um, so I'm going to enable that hotkey. And then um, for that to start working, we may need to actually reload the module again afterward. So there we go. I'm going to launch the Notepad Duo team. And although it still only has uh, Notepad 1 and Notepad 2 as part of the team, um, it's going to launch the DX Nothing window for me. So it does not launch Notepad. Um, it's just going to detect them when I press the hotkey over here. So I've already got two Notepad windows, Window 1 and Window 2. So I'm going to press Control shift alt w and there's one of them, and then Window 2. There they both are in our video FX layout. Um, and here we go. Notepad multiboxing is real. And you can use enable non interspace clone mode to um, do both at the same time. Uh, and of course, mouse and keyboard, everything should work fine. Um, and we can adjust the layout and so on. Tile it. Uh, go back to the dock 
and so on. Um, so that all, all works the same as, um, as you would expect, I guess. Uh, so that's that. Um, and then the question remains, does this work through Sandboxy? So I will open up Sandboxy to show you now. So I'm just going to run a couple of notepad windows uh, through Sandboxy. So here's window one. And uh, yeah. and let's do window two. So here's our two notepad windows again using Sandboxy and I'll restart IS Boxer 2 here. Oops, there it is. Okay, and uh, so all I did was relaunch those as um, sandboxed notepads. And we'll set the team to launch. And again, it'll pop up the DX Nothing window. So here's our empty layout. Let's get window one and window two. So we've got two windows here. And, and there's our sandboxed um, notepads also in the video effects layout and fully working with ISBox or two. Um, so that's how you do it. You can do this with other programs, other games, um, by filling in the details for those games instead of notepad. Um, and we'll see you in the next video.